I've always wanted to keep a four-star admiral waiting. <laughs> I accept this for Jerry Coleman. Jerry, you don't have to come up later. You can just... <laughs> I guess uh, th this is a tremendous surprise that I was even considered for something like this. There are a lot of heroes in this room, and I'm not one of them. I will tell you this. Uh, the admiral talked about the virtue of humility, and uh, I've thought a lot about this, and when this award came to me, believe this or not, I thought about an incident that happened my first day on the only ship I've ever served, USS Thuban, the oldest ship in continuous service to the Navy in 1964. A lot of you in this room will remember this moment. When you come on board a ship, and you're a 22-year-old ensign, just graduating from college. You're not really sure what you know or how to do what you're supposed to do. Here's the picture I'll always have and have had for my entire life. They took me to my first assignment, which was the first division officer on the ship, responsible for everything forward of the smokestack. And they said, Mr. Lamb, this is your division. And I looked out at 22 enlisted men, all dressed in dungarees, ready to chip paint. And I thought to myself, what the heck am I doing here? They all look at me as this young punk that might have a college degree, and what did he happen to know about the Navy? And that was where I learned, and as a matter of fact, when I was looking at the lone sailor statue, I saw that it's a sec second class petty officer. My ticket to my own future was a first class petty officer who fought in World War II, a guy named Hancock. And I could see that I could keep, should keep my mouth shut and get Hancock off in the corner as soon as I could and say to him, boats, Tell me how to do this job. And actually, that's where, for me, I've always looked back at the absolute need for us in our own lives to be as humble as possible. We have a lot to be humble about. And the Navy taught me in the early days of the importance of putting yourself in perspective. You're only as good as those 22 men and I thank you very much for including me in this evening. And go Navy. Thank you. Please enjoy your dinner.